Hey folks, it's Ethan the Farmer here. And I thought I'd come on and talk to you guys a little bit about what I've seen going on with farmers and uh, the justice for them aspect and saving family farms this year. And this year has been nothing but brutal against a small family farmer. Uh, the farm bill is anti-small -farm guy. Uh, the dairy farmers are going under left and right. There's issues with uh, small guys combating bigger guys using pesticides down south. It's just crazy economy, crazy world we live in. And now we got all these tariffs from the trade wars that are adding to cost structure. You know, farming's the only industry where you buy everything at retail and sell it at wholesale. It doesn't work very well for a lot of people. But, um, you know, I just thought I'd come on and talk to you about it and talk to you about things that we're working on to try to help save family farms and get people involved and get people to pay attention. In our society, people don't know how to pay attention. Their attention spans 140 characters. A Twitter, a tweet, that's it. Um, they just don't have the attention span of a mouse. And we've got to do something to start getting these people to wake up and pay attention because it's critical. Family farmers are an endangered species, not only in our country, but around the world. And our country has been a leader in uh, economic growth based on small communities, small business. It's not anymore. We're in trouble. And I want to encourage you folks throughout this holiday season to shop with your local small business, to shop with your local family farmer, your family homestead crafters. Stay away from the Walmarts, stay away from the Costcos, and by God, don't mess with the Amazons. I'm begging you, for the sake of the family farm, for the sake of the future generations, for the sake of our environment. Family farmers that go natural, go sustainable, are a lot more caring and a lot more... Um, in tune with doing things uh, in accordance to the environment. Because when you're doing a natural, sustainable farm, you've got to work with nature. You can't buck it. If you fight nature, you're not going to win. Nature's pretty mean. I mean, there's plenty of people that have tried to fight nature over the years, and it just never ends well. Um, so I want to encourage you folks to do your part. I want to encourage you to shop small. I want to encourage you to, to support family farmers. And... Um, Go ahead and check out our organization, gtkyf.com. There's a tab for the core programs. You can read about the stuff. we got a bunch of programs related to saving family farms and a bunch of information and a ton of really good volunteers and really committed people to being the change, getting involved, doing their part. And if you haven't taken a Big Give Challenge, there's no better time than now to take it. And that's the biggivechallenge.world online. You can read about it. We're challenging everybody to be the change, do their part. So I want to thank you folks. You have a wonderful night. Uh, this is right after Thanksgiving 2018. And uh, I hope we can continue to try to save these family farms. I'm excited to see Bayer having tr troubles from buying Monsanto. I'm excited to see Johnson winning that lawsuit against Monsanto. There's a lot of really good things coming down the pike. And we're really starting to make headway. But it's going to take each one of us. And we've got to start voting with our wallet. And that means supporting the little guy. So thank you. You guys have a great night. Be safe out there.